What's up, FPGA friends? It's Russell here today with a very exciting announcement. My book is now officially available. It's called Getting Started with FPGAs, and it is the book you need if you are a beginner to the world of FPGAs or if you have some experience and you want to beef up your skills. I'll go through everything from what is an FPGA, how does it compare to an ASIC, how does it compare to a microcontroller. I'll then talk about the basic building blocks of FPGAs, the lookup table or LUT, and the flip-flop and how those work. We'll build up on that knowledge to create some components like MUXs, FIFOs, dual port memories. Then I'll talk about some built-in components inside the FPGA common that are block RAMs, uh, PLLs, DSPs, and one killer application of FPGAs, which is high-speed serial communication, or CERTES. I'll talk about how to write a good test bench so you can exercise your code before you program it. I'll talk about how to do math, multiplication, addition, subtraction inside of your FPGA. I'll talk about synthesis. What is, how does it work? What is place and route? How do you program your device? I'll talk about how to cross clock domains successfully and how to avoid the metastable problems that you can sometimes encounter. And finally, I'll talk about how to design a good state machine so you can really control the flow of your code. Um, there's an incredible amount of information here. Um, I'm really excited to finally have this in everybody's hands. Like I said, it's been over two years that I've been working on this. It's by far the most content I've ever put out on FPGAs. So definitely pick it up on my website today, nanland.com, or on Amazon or in bookstores. I also recommend when you buy the book, you should pair it with the Go board in order to get the best value out of the book. Uh, you should also pick up the board because you can uh, run all the code that's inside the book on the board. There's new projects that I have created just inside the book. And so you'll be able to see your code come to life, push buttons, watch LEDs light up, light up the seven segment display, all sorts of fun stuff. Uh, and that's really the best, the best situation if you have both the book and the board together. Um, I will say one more thing, which is that all of the code in the book is written in Verilog and in VHDL. So it doesn't matter what language you wanna learn, both uh, will have equal opportunities for success. Lastly, Thank you to all my YouTube subscribers. Thank you to my Patreon supporters who have stuck with me for the over two years while I got this book out there. I'm beyond excited to get this into your hands. I know you guys are gonna love it. So pick one up today. Thank you again.